full of foreign policy events, 2024 will become a landmark year for Kazakhstan. The country will once again reaffirm its authority on the world stage, taking over as a chair of several major international organizations. Additionally, Kazakhstan is expected to host a number of prestigious forums and summits. Experts note that these events signify a high level of trust and confirm the country's reputation as a stable partner committed to the sustainable development of the world. In an interview with the Yegemen Kazakhstan newspaper, Kazakh President Kazim Jumar Tokayev emphasized that the country pursues a balanced foreign policy, taking into account national interests. The most important directions for Kazakhstan chairmanship have been identified. The primary focus will certainly be the integration and coordination of various international organizations with each other, such as cooperation of the Collective Security Treaty Organization with the interested countries and the UN structural units. Also, Kazakhstan intends to concentrate on fortifying energy interaction among member states of the Shanghai Cooperation Organization, as well as adopting the organization's energy strategy and a new SCO development strategy to enhance its potential. Additionally, plans include the development of the Organization of Turkic States. Kazakhstan also intends to strengthen and develop its foreign economic relations, focusing on the development of logistics and transport infrastructure. This will allow the country to solidify its role in the region and the role of the region in the world as a connecting bridge between Asia and Europe. Kazakhstan is diversifying its transportation lines, placing significant importance on the development of routes that provide access to Southeast Asia. Of course, special focus should be placed on the Trans-Caspian International Transport Route, also called the Middle Corridor, as repeatedly emphasized by the head of state. In his interview, President Tukayev also underlines Kazakhstan's readiness to collaborate with Russia and China on major projects.